Every house is secured. Every person safe. And every place a home for everyone. Welcome to our facility, the Davao City's Public Safety and Security Command Center. It is ambition to have a safe city by using people, information, technology, and intelligent solutions. This is the, the best solutions we can provide to our people by uh, monitoring their daily lives or activities in the streets of Double City. We have manifested our desire to all our constituents to give them uh, a safe home and a safe community. Welcome to our city and welcome to our facility. July of 2010 Public Safety Command Center was created to manage and assess public safety in the city of Davao, but because of the imminent threats on the city's security. Security was then added to the picture, and so became the Public Safety and Security Command Center through another executive order specifically EO No. 18 Series of 2012. The Public Safety and Security Command Center or PSSCC was specifically created to provide protection, security, safety, and risk management to the people of Davao. PSSCC prides itself as the first intelligent operation center solution in the world by integrating intelligence into its operational capability to better manage crime and terrorism traffic, emergency response, and public safety not to mention it has pioneered the implementation of traffic monitoring through a central monitoring system by the use of traffic cameras. In partnership with Abra TK and Associates Incorporated and IBM Philippines, it has utilized technology as tools to better perform its mandate and assist all other line agencies. The PSSCC operates through a very simple manner. It uses coordinative approach to address the different issues on safety and security relative to crime, terrorism, security, traffic, health, and social services, and disaster risk reduction. By using information, people, technology, and intelligent solutions, the PSSCC regularly facilitates coordination meetings to address issues that may need detention relative to public safety and security concerns. Also exercises supervision and control of all 600 personnel under the Civil Security Unit who are deployed to public schools, vital installations, disaster operations, and during significant events as an augmentation to the other line agencies. The PSSCC's CCTV operations is equipped with cutting-edge technology integrated with other line agencies and perform endless safety and security monitoring of the city 24 hours a day and 7 days a week. All incidents monitored by the system, ranging from fire, flood, riots, theft, traffic accidents, suspicious circumstances, and the like are automatically reported to Central 911, who then sends the appropriate responders to the scene of emergency. Under the CCTV Integrated Operations Unit of the PSSCC is the Traffic Operations Center, Intelligent Operations Center, and Technical Support Team. The Traffic Operations Center or TOC is equipped with strategically installed 17 long-range traffic cameras with state-of-the-art traffic signalization system which includes road sensors and smart programmable system. 
TOC is primarily tasked to monitor the traffic situation most especially on major intersections or thoroughfares in the city. It constantly coordinates with Traffic Management Center to better manage the traffic flow or any other traffic-related issues in the city. On the other hand, the Intelligent Operations Center is equipped with 173 security cameras strategically installed all over the city. Points of entry such as checkpoints, seaports, airports, and bus terminals are diligently monitored including public facilities and critical infrastructures. Various road networks which are considered critical are also equipped with security cameras. Aside from the real-time monitoring of the city's security, the IOC system is equipped with technologically advanced system which includes video analytics, used for tracking and identifying of people and vehicles not to mention the IOC's capability to provide data analysis. The IOC system is also equipped with Geographic Information System or GIS map, IOC console, with which is integrated with the central 911 system. Calls taken by the 911 call taker are automatically linked to the IOC console which is a centralized dashboard view that allows Davao City Police Office, Disaster Operations Center, Task Force Davao, Traffic Management Center and Central 911 to monitor events and operations in real time as it also shares all live feeds of the security cameras. Multi-channel unified communication or unified edge wave dispatch is at the heart of the IOC's capability to communicate with other line agencies at any given time. Through the live feeds from CCTVs and a unified communication tool, respective departments will be alerted for emergency in specific locations. This now will result in faster response times for the department in charge of the situation. The Public Safety and Security Command Center has developed its own alarm system to improve interoperability within the Integrated Operations Unit as well as maintain its relentless coordination with the Central 911. It has even utilized the use of social media as a tool to disseminate and reach out to the citizens of Davao. PSSCC has its own traffic update page provided with snapshots to inform the public relative to the city's traffic situation. It also has an interactive page to hear out comments, suggestions, and queries that may be relevant to city's safety and security. Staffed with highly trained personnel and technical team, the PSSCC maintains a constant and up-to-date city risk assessment on criminality, terrorism, and emergencies. Public Safety and Security Command Center has made a remarkable impact in ensuring peace and order, and keeping the citizens of Davao City secure. Proving its worth, it has given numerous help to investigations, apprehensions, tracking and identification of people or vehicles, and most importantly in providing situational awareness. The Public Safety and Security Command Center indeed puts into concrete actions the city government's strong commitment to minimize if not totally suppress all forms of criminalities and to lessen if not totally prevent possible injuries from violation of the traffic rules and regulations, city ordinances, existing laws, and other common emergencies. The trouble with us in government is that we talk too much act too slow and do too little.